What's up everybody, welcome back to a brand new video. I'm Sam Alexa and in today's tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to loosely lace your Nike Air Max 90s. The first thing you're going to want to do is take the lace and thread it through the two bottom holes. Just like that and then take the lace and thread it through the other bottom hole as well. And then you're going to want to hold the two tips of the laces together and then pull up from the very top just like that and that was just to make sure that the laces are the same length on either side so the next thing we're going to do is take the lace and thread it through the second hole up on the other side of the shoe when you do this you don't want to pull the lace completely tightly you want to leave it a little bit loose so don't pull it all the way. Next thing we're going to do is take the other lace and thread it through the second hole up on the other side of the shoe. So just going ahead and threading it through. Just like that, once again, leaving it a little bit loose. Then we're going to take this lace and thread it through the third hole up on the other side of the shoe. And then take this lace and thread it through the third hole up on the other side of the shoe. Just like that. And as you can see, we're already starting to get that loose lace look. So we're just going to repeat this process all the way to the top. So we just go to take this lace and thread it through the next available hole on the other side of the shoe. Just like that. And then just take this lace and thread it through the next available hole on the other side of the shoe. And then take the lace and thread it through the hole on the other side. And then take this lace and thread it through. Once you get to this part on the tongue, it's completely up to you if you want to thread the lace through or not. But personally, I think it makes the tongue sit much more comfortable if you do. So if you do want to, you just take the lace and thread it through. Make sure you keep the lace flat when you do so. And then thread the lace through the second from the very top hole on the other side of the shoe. Just like that. And then take this lace and thread it through the hole, but over the top of the other lace. Once again, keeping the lace flat and then thread it through the second from the very top hole on the other side of the shoe. Once you get to the very top hole, rather than threading the lace over the top, we're going to thread it underneath. So you just get a little bit of lace sticking out of the top. And then take this lace and thread it through the very top hole just like that so as you can see you have the laces loose going all the way up and then you have a bit of lace sticking out at the very top now I'm going to go ahead and show you how to do it on the right shoe as well so getting into the right shoe then take the lace and thread it through the two bottom holes so just going ahead and threading the lace through and then take the lace and thread it through the other bottom hole as well And then you're going to want to take the two tips of the laces, hold them together and then just pull up. And that was just to make sure that the laces are the same length on either side. So the next thing you're going to want to do is take this lace and thread it through the second hole up on the other side of the shoe. So we're just going to thread it through, making sure that the lace is flat. The next thing you're going to want to do is take this lace and thread it through the second hole up on the other side of the shoe. Just like that, once again, leaving the lace a little bit loose. So you're just going to want to take the lace and thread it through the third hole up on the other side of the shoe. And then take this lace 
and fed it through the third hole up on the other side of the shoe. And then you're going to want to take this lace and fed it through the next available hole on the other side of the shoe. Making sure that the lace is flat and leaving it a little bit loose. Then take this lace and fit it through the next available hole on the other side of the shoe. Just like that. And then take the lace and fit it through the hole on the other side of the shoe. And then take this lace and fit it through. And then once you get to this part on the tongue, you're just going to take the lace and thread it through. And then through the second from the very top hole on the shoes. Just like that. And then take this lace and thread it through the hole, but over the top of the other lace. and then thread it through the second from the very top hole on the other side of the shoe. Then take the lace and thread it through the very top hole, but rather than threading it over the top, we're going to thread it underneath, just like that. So you have a little bit of lace hanging over the edge and then take this lace and thread it through the very top hole on the other side of the shoe. Just like that. So that was how to loosely lace your Nike Air Max 90s. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you what they look like on feet. So let's get into it. Let's go. Yeah. 